What a day. Us. I've always had an unconditional guarantee for trouble in my life. <laughs> trouble? What would you really wish if none of your problems ever existed? I mean, you know, that last wish with Genie on your side. It's all you and what you wish for. You promised that then we go to Sigi? Yeah. I only wish a good man to share my last breath with. Oh, Berta! Never thought you'd be so romantic. I'm shocked, really shocked. Let's go, okay? You know what's really important to me? No, I don't. We know. have done Fast. so many things together. You promised that we go to Sigi, okay? I know you're gonna think I'm crazy. Jesus. Fast, just say it. I only want to have a life without Come on! Fuck! Say it! Come on! Say it! What? With your nice smile. Because you never let me talk. You mean you stop when I ask you to? Well, what choice do I have? Oh my god, Siggy, don't do this! Please, Siggy! What's five hours and fifty minutes to you? I've heard all of these words so many times. Let me make that one call! All I gotta do is call! Excuse us, boss. Wait a minute. Oh my god, no! My dog! My dog can get it for you! We're taking care of the dog. Ziggy! That's a promise. Ziggy, please, Ziggy. For some reason, I don't think these two are going to make me any happier. <laughs> she deserves to die. Come back, girls. She was a stupid, and now she's dead. I don't know where to start. The beginning is always nice. G. 
Jesus, fuck, cut it out. Is that what's under this, what I think it is? And has been brought to my home, where my family resides? Where her family resides? Please hear me out, okay? So don't tell us a funny story. Uh, probably you want us killed. Shit, I gave her 8 to 1 that we'd be dead by now. Well, Fuss, you are a heartbeat away from collecting on that bat. Absolutely. Absolutely. Okay, 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 all right, all right. Please don't, okay? People with money act really weird these days. Yeah, really weird. Let me get this straight. The stuff you're referring to is the stuff on the table, correct? That's correct. On the table. What kind of a table is that anyway? And that package is the cocaine that you and your partner guaranteed me that you could sell. Is that correct? That's correct. Guaranteed. Well, actually, what we said is that we unconditionally guaranteed it. So you and your partner are being what? Huh? Correct, or what? Returning this for a store credit, is that correct? That's correct, a credit. <laughs> this story is definitely not funny. Definitely, absolutely not funny. Not funny. Gee, you sure got lots of fruits around. <laughs> Fast. Okay. I give you guys a credit, all right? Yes, a credit. Your story touched me so much. Do you like the sound of three? Three? Two is just perfect. Now three, that's just fucking perfection. I mean, that's the sound of jingle bell in my ears. Fine. Then we make it two days. Don't forget. Two days. <laughs> <laughs> almost had three days. I was trying to be friendly. Wow, thank you. It's two days now. It's easy. We just got to sell it. Easy? Come on. Sell the shit. Okay. Then you do the easy job and I do what I do.
Hey, Naomi, come here. Fuck! What the fuck was that for? For the bad things you're gonna do tonight and won't tell me about. Lousy mother! I ought to do it again. Now we're even. No. We are never even. You will regret that. No, get out of my sight. Get out. Open the door, huh? I don't want to hear it. You don't want to hear it? Well, excuse me, but while you were here fancying yourself, I was in that jungle out there trying to make some credit. And were you able to get some monkey credit? Huh? Hey, fast! We got fucking serious problems here! Aren't you going to do something about it? I am. I relax my legs with a whole new way of walking. Honey, you're taking life way too seriously. Where's that coming from, huh? That. I call it the cock walk. Cock walk? I try to be a lion instead of a donkey. On this asphalt jungle under the sun. Fuss. You're a sick, a very sick woman. No, really, I mean it. You should try it. You know, see, you work so hard as being a toughie. You gotta relax your ass a little bit. Give yourself a little time off from that emancipated shit. <laughs> Is that the right tone of laughter? No. A bit more tragic, more like this. <laughs> All right. Did anyone call? Jesus. Both parties are disinterested. Great. I want to hear the sound of your laughter with your head 10 feet under the water after 10 minutes. Fast. Are you listening to me? See, why don't you just take that shit, take some cash, and leave my place? I've got a romance to attend to in about 10 minutes, you know? All right, all right, okay. Hey, I'm out. Great! Okay, I'm gone. Good. Hey, is that her again? Yeah. I'm gone, okay. Hey, fast, you have 48 hours to learn deep 
water swimming. Bye. Look at me. Caught walking out of your place. How uncivilized. Mm -hmm. How incredibly uncouth. Ten feet deep, honey. Your laughter will sound like a huge pregnant frog. Oh, 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 oh. Get in, or should I open the door for you? Oh, hey, lady, can I give you an address? Do you believe in heaven? Huh? Heaven? It seems you are heading that way anyway. If you be more patient, I'll get us there even faster. <laughs> for my sick child. Please, we have no money. Trust me. You mean there is no save and no money? No. Promise. Yes. That you will forget my face. You are a very, very good girl. Okay. Be cool. I leave. So you could go to your sick child. Have a good life. Take courage. No, I mean, if my mother ever found out about us, she would have you flayed. Flayed? Sounds good. <laughs> what is flayed anyway? Having one flayed is having their skin taken off. Ooh. When they're still alive. <laughs> brave? Brave my ass. <laughs> <laughs> I think you meant I was stupid. <laughs> Anyway, I mean, what do I care? I have her coke. I have her daughter. Maybe I'm lucky and she'll let me have a book one day. You're dreaming. You're <laughs> right, you are stupid. <laughs> Why? Are you scared? I'm scared of you. Scared of me? Why? I love you. That's all I need. You're so pretty. Don't call me pretty. Beautiful. That's better. <laughs> Gorgeous. Yeah, you're talking. <laughs> <laughs> 
dream girl. <laughs> Kiss me. Where? Everywhere. 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 understand what a guarantee is. But I'm asking you philosophically, are there any guarantees in life? There are no guarantees in life, but there are guarantees in death, which I can guarantee you if this money is not in my hands at 9 o'clock tomorrow night. Wow, look at this. Pure drugs in the back seat. I gotta hang up, Ziggy. Call you later. With the door wide open? This must be a trap. You think so? Or someone is worse than stupid? I know. I shouldn't be doing this. I saw it on TV screen. If you kill a cop, you're a dead mate. But I gotta tell you, that thing you got in your hand belongs to me. Hand it over, and we forget about everything. Cool it. Come on, give it to me. Here, take it, girl. Okay. Now, easy. Give me your handcuffs. Cool down. Give me your keys. You're making a big mistake. Now you stop stealing people's belongings, okay? I hope you have learned your lesson, baby. Don't take what doesn't belong to you, okay? In my business, we called it robbery. Okay. Good girls, bye-bye. You're right, it was a trap. Everybody. Whoa, Berta, you're getting really styled. Everybody when did you steal this one? Last night. All right, now let me get this straight. You handcuffed two cops, then took back the cocaine, then told them just to forget what just happened. Is that correct? Yes, that's correct. And you think this is normal behavior? For a professional criminal like myself, yes. And you would be who? Michael Corleone? Oh, fuss, don't start again. Please. Unbelievable. Forget, forget I ever said anything, okay? Any word. You're weird. Oh man. my god. Berta, would you stop parking a stolen car in a tow-way zone ever again? Because I'm tired of walking after a Mercedes ride. How about a sign with a no parking for stolen cars on it? I'm sorry, Britta, but it was the nicest car you ever stole. Boss, stop it. There's an ash. Did you see that? That's a new ass. Man, she dipped the fries in the chocolate syrup. Look, she's really eating it.
got a little gift for ya. Sunny day. Cute little car. Ready to do business? Shit, shit, shit. Shit. <sighs> what do we got in here? Let me see. Automatic. Brand new brakes. Leather seats. Rover. Shit, shit, shit. And there I thought it was impossible to use the word shit more than 32 times in one sentence. If history tells us anything, Max is here to prove that nothing is impossible. Nothing. Ain't that right, Maxie? I got to agree with her on that. Oh, thank you for your insight, Michael Corleone. <laughs> okay, all right. All right, shit. Let's just get on with the deal. Yeah, just get on with the deal. <laughs> and Max, please. No bullshit. Oh, shit. shit, man. Yeah. Turn around. Get lost. Shit, Maxie. Don't start. I get to big cars, you would say only the small ones sells. If we bring you small ones, you want them big. Uh, What's your problem, eh? Shit. I can give you a grand for her. A grand. A grand? Berta, you said she'd pay three. You <laughs> promised she would. I told you, this chick is getting to be an old bitch. Hey. Hey, what? A grand? This car was clock doing 195 on the Autobahn last week. In a second gear. The Autobahn is in Germany, you know? Jersey, Germany. What's the difference? Okay, you little shit. Two grand and that's that, or take that shit out of here. Take that shit out of here. Berta, come on, let's take it. It's always a pleasure doing business with you, Max. You are drinking my Coke. You owe me 350. Listen, Berta. You're a sorry piece of shit. Yeah, piece of shit. Maxi. I broke the thing, okay? And this costs you 350. Are you listening? Can you tell from the tone of my voice that I'm not kidding shit, you? Shit, Berta. Shit, you're shit. You're fucking shit. I can't believe it. Shit! I am, yes. And you know, all what I want is my money, okay? Did she ask for it? Yeah. Did I fucking ask for it? Did I want this? No, but you're drinking this, you know? And this is the same. So don't push me, Maxi. Here. Here, you should take it and get the hell out of my place. Out of your oh, place. First. Could you break a five? Uh -uh. Shit. Shit. A deal? Yo, you shit is ever so ugly again. You sick bastards. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Oh. Hey, woman, calm down. There is nobody moving up, okay? <laughs> hey, there is nobody there. <laughs> it's you again. <laughs> oh, no, it's her. <laughs> the crazy taxi driver. <laughs> oh, my God, woman. <laughs> Just cut the speed. I'm seeing colors back here. <laughs> She's gonna kill her! She's got with the nuts! Shit! Jesus, man! Would you cut the speed? <laughs> you were this girl's cap before and you got into it again? Must don't start, okay? Hey, 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 Believe in heaven or <laughs> man, that bitch shook my brains. How can I ever be cool again? 
so I'll go see Buddy Rich tonight. Buddy Rich? Wow. I wonder what's in a name. I mean, what if she'd been so rich if her name was Buddy Poor? <laughs> you said it, girl. She's loaded. Ask for 250. Two She'll 15. pay. Stop fucking dreaming. I'm only gonna see her and see how much I could sell. I mean, anything. Anything at all. I can dream all I want, okay? She's a cokehead, and we got the coke. So what's dreaming, huh? Uh, That's been your problem since you were a kid. You're still a kid. You never stop dreaming. <laughs> so what? My goodness. Why do you think I went to Betty Ford for three months? Wow, three months. That's a long time. Well, I guess to drive me out of business, that's for sure. That too. But mostly it was to be better friends with people like you. Can you believe that I was thinking of you? I mean, really thinking of you. Well, buddy, I admire you greatly, but if you don't buy that load of coke for me, you're gonna be my pal bearer as well as my friend. Ah, oh, no. I hate shoes. Okay, darling. Let's take a look at this. You just said you just went to Betty Ford in your team. Oh, I know. I'm going to ignore this line. Before you go, I'm going to sweep it into the garbage. I hate it when people can do that. Anyway, now explain to me the other thing, your knocking it out thing after we have other names. It's easy, darling. When you look at my walls, what do you see? Some pictures, but they're white. Exactly. The white ones are even more precious. They're very expensive. They're minimalist masterpieces. The white ones. So, what do we do? I mean, still some white artworks? Nonsense. I've been thinking about this little problem you've been having with Sigi. And I think I got it correct. I'm going to give you a Jewish name. And Alberta is going to be Italian. I don't know, buddy, but I get the feeling Ziggy is an equal opportunity killer. No matter where you're from, Rome, New York, or Tel Aviv. You got to knock this lifestyle out of your head. Well, buddy, I mean, if you're not doing this line, I'll get all sorts of ideas here. Touch it, and you lose a hand. Just forget the request. As I was saying, what we sometimes call art is an actuality hustle. And you know that. You're a hustler yourself. I hate scars. The artist hustles some white paint on a canvas, and then hustles some gallery owner into believing that it is indeed a work of art who in turn hustles some schmuck from New Jersey or Copenhagen to part with a great deal of money for it? Who in turn hustles his friend into believing that he knows something about great artwork? And before you know it, a piece of all white painted canvas will have the price of a piece of heaven. So all we gotta do is just do the hustle? Exactly. What do we have to do to join it? Instead of that silly drug and store robbery hustle, you could be doing the art hustle and making thousands of dollars. Once we changed your names into two good Jewish and Italian girls. So, all we gotta do is just to become Jewish and Italian? 
Exactly. Player? Do you have any tapes? I don't have tapes. You don't? Fuck it, man. A little bit more passion, please. Hey. Stand up. Boss, you better tell me we are going to paint something beautiful. What about a bird? Boss, I'm waiting. What about painting a horse? A dog? What about a naked man? At least I would have some fun. No, Berta, you're way too old-fashioned, okay? The word today is minimal. So, you're gonna paint your brain. I heard that obnoxious remark, which I will ignore. Minimalism is a movement in art. The less you try to say, the more impact what you do say will have. And maximalism is the next step. But we will remain loyal to the roots of minimalism, since there is more money in it. And easier to do. Did you know that a blank canvas once sold for a half a million? No, really? Yeah. Oh, wow. Let's leave it blank. Stand up. Boy, come on, help me. 
You know what? If you ain't start painting, I'm gonna paint the fuck out of you. Hey, are you crazy right, or take what? It. Take it. Thank you. What should I do? Paint your shirt or what? <laughs> or your ass white? <laughs> <laughs> okay, come on in and beat me half. Come on, come on. They won't even pay 10 cents for this. Not a penny. Why not? Because you have located the sad spot right in the center of the painting. That's much too commercial, way too harmonious. Commercial is good. That means money. Isn't that the reason we are doing this here? Huh? No. Commercial is bad. The less commercial one makes it, the more they're willing to pay for it. Commerce does not have anything to do with art. Oh, come on, Fuss, come on. I mean, I'm really out of patience, you know? And I don't know, that's what Buddy said at least. Fuck Buddy. Who is Buddy? There. I make it a little bit more beautiful. Man, you just said art shouldn't be beautiful. Hey, what is this? Would you get your fucking stinky feet out of my painting? I'm making it more beautiful. The world today is minimal. For to stop repeating what I say, okay? And stop copying my art. I hate to say this, but you look good. Damn good. Do I look as good as I did before? Or am I dreaming? I can't believe this. By this time tomorrow, I will have a bullet in my brain which used to be inside there. Very good looking head of hair. And she's worried about her looks. Dollface, they'll have to find your brain before they can put a bullet in it. And what am I doing to prevent becoming a dead woman? I'm dressing like it's Halloween. Puss, I gotta hand it to you. This is you at your best. Oh, really? I've done it this time. Wait, 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 I gotta pee. She's really taking a pee. Are you nuts or what? <sighs> uh... Look what you have done to a nice neighborhood. Oh, have you ever heard of artistic performance? Your performance is running over my shoes. Oh, peeing is one of the highest order. Mm. Oh my god, Fuss, you are not repairable. I'm gone. Come in. <sighs> Your stinking river is flowing down the hill. Are you coming or what? Yeah. Hey, 
Say, is she in a good mood today? The boss will be out soon. Just sit there and wait. alone, okay? I'm really not in the mood. Mm. Good. Try some? Yeah, okay. Why not? Hey, be careful. I just drove away. Oh. That hole. Mm. Man, they all got holes. Sure tastes good. You want another one? Yeah, why not? It tastes really good. Mm -hmm. Why on earth is she scared? Huh? She's my daughter, Jesus. You tell that girl that her mother is mad as hell. And if she's home by this evening, I'll cut her freaking head off. Do like I said, or I have to have her breakfast tomorrow. Scared? My own daughter? Do you believe this shit? Like I'm a monster. She's very delicate. How the fuck would you know? How do you know? Uh, well, I mean, I just simply heard. I mean, look, all young girls in a certain age are delicate. Just kids. Hey, hey, guys. New outfit. Let me look at you. Come. Come here. Come on. Aren't you two looking fabulous? I love it. Turn around. Wow! Hot chicks! <laughs> give me a walk. Yes, give me a walk. should look that way. Wow! What a catwalk! This is the finest you two ever looked. Really great! <laughs> I'll need a few dollars, Ziggy. Where are you going? What's it to you? Aren't you done with me? I want some air. The house is getting too small for my white visionary taste. <laughs> Come here. Don't go to that stupid club. And don't be late. Don't you love how she plays the angry camp commander? That's my favorite thing she does. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck are you laughing at? Huh? We weren't laughing. 
Look, if I had the guts, I'd go after Berta right here. Hey! <coughs> yes, dear. I see what you mean. See? Okay, now, why you both are here? Don't tell me you got the cash 12 hours early. No, absolutely not. Da Vinci. <laughs> and you fast, huh? Who will you be? Now, let me see. Um, you are always the Mamoran of the both. Uh, ma -ma 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 -ma. Picasso. Yeah? Yeah? <laughs> Picasso? <laughs> I'm going to do something I've never done before in my life. So you're going to become a patron of the arts? No. I'll give you another additional 12 hours. 12 hours? Let's say six to buy the paint and practice painting. Um, another six to develop a genius style. And 12 to go paddle your still wet masterpieces. But Ziggy, it took Rembrandt 20 years to sell a painting. Well, so it was a good for Rembrandt that he didn't owe me a hundred grand. So, that means we have time until... This time tomorrow night. Fuck. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> well, there's a lot of plenty of time. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. Say, Ziggy, what's it with the holes in the fruit? Oh, that's just another experiment. I call it fruit fucking. Fruit fucking? You mean it literally? Yeah. Men do it. Yeah. Men do it? You mean... Somebody already did it? Last night. Why are you asking? Why are you asking? It is really good. <laughs> Now we got 24 hours to paint some fucking paintings so they can put it on our gravestones that we had an artistic band. Gravestone? What gravestone? You know, the thing they put on a grave that tells people who is under it and who got their liver shot out because they owed a hundred grand. Jesus, Bert, who's gonna pay for a fucking gravestone for you? They're gonna put you to the rest in Pottersfield. If I'm out at Pottersfield, they are gonna dump you in the East River. That's for those who can't afford fucking Pottersfield. Okay, you're putting your fucking ass to a fancier place than mine? <laughs> Listen to me. I can tell you a few times. Yeah. Do you want? Tell us. Yeah. Come on. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Concentration, concentration. I can see... Come on, ah, hurry up! I can see a lot of 
happiness and music and a good life and uh, money. 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 What about the money? Oh. Tell us about the money. Oh. What about the money? <laughs> Hey, cool down, cool down, okay? I don't know what this is about. I was just trying to steal the car, okay? No one steals what's practically ours. You girls are thieves? Like myself? Is she for real? Okay, I mean, we are really in a partnership on the car, okay? I can help you sell it if you chill out. You mean, right this day and in cash? Yeah, absolutely. Cash divided in half. Yes. Promise. Okay. Yes. Let's drive. Please. Get the gun off. Come on. Okay, partner. Here I go again, falling in love again. Never thought it could happen to me again. Can't believe I'm doing this again. Time can I celebrate? It's messing up my head. I never look my best. It will never be the same. Oh, hey, it's messing up my head. My daughter is my life. Can you take her as your own? Oh, hey, it's messing up my head. Your love is having sense. I wish I could be sure. if the prize is right. Go on, get on top of it. Yeah, chop on it. Maxi, you buy this now and then sell it for half a million in 10 years. Hey, Maxi, the damn van is right out of the factory. Right out of the factory. Right off the street, where I got joyrided by Puerto Rican gangbangers for about 17 months. <laughs> gangbangers. <laughs> Come on, man. Wow. And look at this brand new leather seats here. Best in the free world. Look at this one. The CD capacity. Totally programmable. You know, I mean, it's a fucking jukebox on wheels. Cool. 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 Fucking <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, they're pretty. They're pretty. All of them are this weekend's bonus on top of the car. Both are 18. And guess what? They are so pretty. You can sell them to your customers as eternal virgins. <laughs> Jesus. Surprise, surprise. You're really good to me. Jesus, you're really good to me. Yeah, that's what I said. She's really good to me. Jesus, you're really good to me. She's really good to me. She's good to me. She's good to me. Yeah, she's good to you. Oh, okay, Maxi. Uh, Put three in my hand, call the cabbie. You will never see me again. So, Maxi, give me the money. Yeah. We said three? Yeah. Yeah, here. 
Thank you. See you. The keys are inside? Yeah. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. I do forgetting everything over and over again. What the fuck is it this time? This beautiful looking girls sitting in the back. Do you think I would let them go for lousy 3,000? What? Are you out of your mind? Watch it, Berta, really. Watch it. Hey, Maxi, that makes another 500, Maxi. Did I want the girls, huh? Did, did I ask for girls? Yeah, did did I want the girls? Huh? Did, did I ever girl? ask for girls? Did, did I ask girl? for girls? Did you ask I for want girl? cars, no girls. Yeah, she wants cars, no girls. Hey, come on, man, look at you. You have two beautiful ladies. You can close down your chop shop and open the... Hey, 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 welcome to Maxim's in Portugal, Virgin's Island. I want an empty car. Yeah, she wants an empty car. No fucking beer cans and sure as hell no fucking hookers. Just pay me. Give me another 500 taxis waiting. Come on, come on. Did man. I ever say anything about a woman? No woman. Hey, give me the money, okay? Shit. Shit, all right. All right. Hasta la vista, amigo. Don't ever let me see you around this part of the world no more, okay? Go Hasta now. La vista. Go. Great, man. Hasta Thank go, you, go, go. go. Bye bye. Shit. Hey, girls, here. <laughs> well, hello girls! We're gonna do a hell of a change around this neighborhood together. Good morning to you two gorgeous hookers. Hookers? Yeah. Did you say hookers? Yeah, hookers. Just say hookers. Hookers. Come on, sweetie. Hookers. Fuck off. Oh, come on. Relax. Hey. Girls. And me. Who's that? You don't see the hard, dishonest work I put every day in to earn a living. I know. I know. You should might not see it that way, but it's my job. I get up, plan my day ahead, find my spot. Do you have an idea how to steal, how, how, how to steal, uh, how, 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 how to hit the, the right score, how to steal the right car and, 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 and strike the right, at the right time? Huh? Do you, do you, do you, huh? Did you ever run the store with me, huh? Did you? No. No. You're always busy dealing big cards. Of course. Uh? No? Come look. On. Look, look where we are. Look at it. Come on, Bert. You've got to believe in yourself. Oh, really? I mean, you know, we've got to give it all we've got. This is going to be good. Ah, fuck. You'll you. see. Bert. Enough. I'm only looking at the size from now on. That one is just too small for our needs. We need uh, something bigger. You know, small galleries can meet small cash outlet. <sighs> Whoa, look 
at that one. That one is great. That's a carpet store. No, it's very avant-garde. What's that? Avant-garde? Avant-garde is a Lithuanian term meaning cool for tomorrow's taste. Oh, really? I hope they agree with you in this painting store. Well, let me tell you one thing. If that stock isn't back up to 130 by this time, next week, I'm gonna show you the spot where Hoffa ended up. Complain, eh? Naomi, you're wearing next to nothing. It's an invitation to perverts to have the filthy way with you. So please go back to your room and change without protest for once. And you're gonna give yourself a heart attack. <laughs> That's what the pills are for. What's that on your arm? Nasty. No, it's a nightmare. I'm going to kill you for it. You're pulling a gun on your mother? Where did you get it? It's a present. From father. That bastard bought you a gun. He taught me how to use it too. So back off! You're sleeping with women now? Both of them. With Fuss and Berta. At the same fucking time. And you know why I let them? To hurt you. You know what? I've learned how good it feels to hurt you in that way. And I'll keep doing it whenever I get the chance. They are dead. Kill them both! Drive up to their house and make holes in their melon heads, you sorry fuck! Did you go to art school? Where? Well, where indeed? <laughs> Perhaps the question is, where did I not go to art school? I was ejected from a number of them before landing at... Uh... Uh, let me guess. The Sorbonne. Sorbonne. Wow, you guys know me so good already. What did I tell you, Al? Everybody knows Sorbonne. Sir Bones? Is that something you want to fucking brag about? <clears throat> well, um, my friend here was forced to do some work with criminal elements to support herself during her studies. And it has obviously turned her into what the French call crude, crude, crudity, crudity. Crudité. Ah, exactly. Right, that. Obviously. I did? What? Am I a crocodile now, or what? Why don't we introduce ourselves, huh? You're damn right, we forgot it. Uh, well, uh, my name is um, El De Mato, which, as we know, is Italian, of course. Yes. And I am Goldstein, a member of the Jewish fate. We're both minimalist. M minimalists, you know. Uh, well, here are paintings. <laughs> oh. Um, <clears throat> um, I mean, 
the rougher the better um, true art uh, real courage uh, less beauty and more rage <laughs> yes, certainly so uh, you you've worked together on these uh, no I mean yes actually um, she does the big ones and I do the small ones, you know, but we share the money in half. I mean, a team is a team, no matter what. <laughs> we can offer you our most original works for the right price. Yeah. I mean, um, you know, you could be the only, the first and only gallery who can glance at our works and even have the possibility to take us under contract. <laughs> we don't offer it that way. <laughs> the price is no problem. You, you have to just name it, you know? Yeah. Name a price and we will come together. Yeah, I, yeah. Mean, I mean, just tell me, how much would this one go for? Yeah. I mean, perhaps you can always talk about hers, that little one, but yeah, how maybe, much? Maybe that's better. I mean, they are smaller and naturally cheaper. And then we can go to hers. <laughs> But uh, perhaps the lady is more concerned about art. Size is not everything, you know? My dear Foss, in these rough times, you know, maybe a lady, this lady, wants to get something smaller with value, you know? And then size does matter. Size always matter, you know? Why, you puny, phony fucking bitch? I was the one who taught you about art. You were not an artist until I made you an artist. Of course I am an artist. And I intend to paint your face on the sidewalk if you don't shut your mouth. Ladies, we don't operate that way. I'll ask you, madam. Judge these two works yourself. A minimalist classic work expression of mine versus to this i don't know banal junkyard of colors and shapes junkyard we don't operate that way <sighs> issue out of this, okay? Our situation is shitty enough. Well, thanks for reminding yourself. What do we do now? Mama Sita is the last place before us, Maddie. I'm starving, man. Me too. Mama Sita is arrogant bitch. The food is okay. Let's go in. Hi, Mama Sita. Long time no see. How's life? It sucks. Oh, as long as it sucks good. It sucks like raw eggs. With white shark teeth. I'm glad I'm not sucked by your life. Huh. Okay, okay, okay. Enough of sucking. Could we get some order around here? Order? Surely. You came here to eat. No, Mama Sita. We came here to... Sell. Look what we got here for you. 97% pure. Or perhaps you can have these paintings. Original. Of deep passion and hostility. Fresh paintings. I see. I have your attention. That's good. What she means is we are in a position that we can uh, give you only for cash deal a very good one-time offer. Perhaps you can have them both, you know, the paintings and the cocaine. All of them together for only $85,000. I mean, that's a savings of 25%. I mean, if you're gracious, you could give us some meat to go with. That would be great. I mean, you know, you know, those paintings are $10,000 each. Stop it, Britta. Stop it, all right? They're worth a thousand, not 10,000. Why do you always have to exaggerate? Okay, all right. Did I say 10,000? Okay, 
I meant thousand. Yeah, thousand. What do you think, huh? Hey, Juanita! Hey, mamacita, what do you want me to do? Muchachos, what is so cojones? She is big. God, you know, she is big. really Elefant fucking cojones. big. You fucking bastards, leave. Why do you always have to do that, huh? Muchacho. Why do you always have to say something on top of it? You said it already. Yes, she is big. I am Can't you just big. stop for good? Come no, on, I can't. Too. I'm going to chop your titties. That was all we wanted, you know? Does it stink? How is it? Very good. One. <laughs> a real bitch. <laughs> You're so funny sometimes. Do I sound funny to you? Huh? Hey, I want for you to look into my eyes and say, Wow, Bert, you look so funny. All right. Wow, Bert, you look like shit. with a great nose in their field of vision. Do you know the best way to keep a guy from masturbating is to operate on his nose? Fuss, I'm ruining you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you can masturbate. Hey, stop it, stop it. Wait, Fuss. Melinda? Rocket Summer! I need you again. <laughs> Those bastards stole my daughter, my cocaine, and my money. But the last match. I want them both dead. She's the last match! Until this time tomorrow night. Last money must walk you at you.
Hey, Fess. Good to see you. Good to see you too, Vaseline Basmati. So you got the coke? And you, the dough? I didn't call you Fess. You called me? So let's get this over. There's 50 grand, take it. And pass the coke over. Roy, at 50? We said 100. Stop being greasy, all right? <laughs> well, you know it's 50 now and 50 tomorrow. Jesus, and the check is in the mail? You know what? You're lucky that Berta is not here. If she was here, she would have kicked the shit out of you just for laughs. Hey, hey watch, where aren't you talking to? Shit, man, I should have listened to her. This is one bad, greasy, Vaseline dub, motherfucker. Miss Maddie, look. I ain't got time for this, okay? And it's not me either. I got some angry people to pay out there. <laughs> it seems to me like this is going to be like in the movies where we go back and forth and back and forth and then I'm gonna kick the shit out of you for being a jerk. Hey, this is the second warning, girl. Watch it. Miss Maddie, you're making me nervous. And that's not good for any legal deal, you know? You said a hundred and I want the hundred now. No, I can't do that. Look, you know I'm good for the other fifty, huh? So take the envelope and come back tomorrow. <laughs> What the fuck is kidding you guys, huh? Did she come up with the money like she promised? She wants to give us 50 now and the rest tomorrow. Fast, there is no tomorrow, okay? You fuck, there is no tomorrow. And we need the cash now and not tomorrow, okay? Berta, of course there's a tomorrow. You may not be in it, but it will be here. <laughs> Your partner was just telling me you would just kick the shit out of me. <laughs> just for laughs. <laughs> Great. I think you killed her. Do you think she is dead? I mean, I hope so. If not, oh my god. I don't know. I mean, she will not like that. Shit. Get the money and let's go out. Are you sure nobody knows you live here? Jesus, I can't believe this. It's the fries with chocolate syrup, girl. Yeah. <laughs>
I knew you live here. Come on, girls. Let's get the guns. Shoot! And I'll shoot back! Now I'm going to shoot! Nobody kills my daughter, except me. Not before she pays me. Okay, I make you an offer. We gotta shoot those bastards together. You got your money and I have my daughter. Those two belong to history now. Naomi. Naomi, come back to me, now. <laughs> Naomi. I'm gonna shoot! Shoot! 
Huh? It's not really like you. Ah! Up on the roof. You're screaming our head off. Oh! I was wearing this little light in here. A bulletproof jacket. Oh, God. Aren't you ashamed? You want yourself one? And you don't get me also one? Oh, I swear it was going to be under your Christmas tree. I'm a die, you bitch! You're happy now? Additional guarantee. Love is in 